I've been a Methodist my whole life, which is kind of exciting, and we moved around a lot. So when I say I really appreciate the connection of the United Methodist Church, I really appreciate the connection of the United Methodist Church. When I run into people that I was in, um, that I was at camp with in Virginia, or I run into my youth minister from Colorado, or anyone else from Austin that I, that I when I was there, um, really, the connection is a is an important thing that we all know we're we're in this body of Christ together. Well, I think in general, um, it's to continue that we can continue to make disciples of Jesus Christ for the transformation of the world. Um, that has been our call uh, since even before we were born. Um, for so many decades and years and centuries, um, we've been uh, called to be disciples and to be leaders and to be leading uh, new disciples. Some of the things are the same and some of the things are different. We're still, as Scott uh, Gilliland would call it, the unicorn justices, justice unicorns that are, um, that are active in, the, or in the, the neighborhood, the community, the city of Richardson, DFW. But I know that there's also a lot of um, new uh, um, mission type in, uh, environments coming up. There's some significant increase in evictions and the working poor is having to deal with how they find childcare, how they, um, how they pay for childcare, how they, how they handle things like this. And all of this falls into uh, the role of a deacon to connect the church with the world. And so in finding a lot of this uh, partnership where we can expand um, reaching from the church into the world to help transform their lives, um, that's important to me and to uh, the, the ministry, I think, of Arapaho.